not outside necessarily at this second, but over the next several hours, mainly after lunchtime today, that's when I'm pinpointing on into the afternoon. That's when it does look like that the rain's going to become widespread, moving into the southern part of the state first, and then everybody gets in on these showers as we look ahead at this afternoon. Here we go on Live Doppler 13 radar. I want to put this into motion. You can see a lot of that moisture is still at bay back to our west, but there is a very strong center of low pressure that is sitting in southern Missouri right now, and you can kind of see that counterclockwise rotation around that center of low pressure that is going to work its way toward us it'll pass by just south of central indiana but there's a ton of rain associated with that so that's why we're going to call for those showers in the forecast today so it's a quiet start early on a live look over downtown where the clouds have been increasing through the overnight we're currently sitting at 51 degrees so that just goes to show you the difference cloud cover can make it's certainly a mild morning and temperatures will still be mild today, despite the fact that we'll see those increased clouds and the rain chance still looking at Indy to top out around 66 degrees later today. So we have a lot of dry time now, but let's walk you through when that rain's going to arrive. 66, your forecast high in Indy today, around 65 in Columbus. So again, another seasonal day. Pretty normal to see those kind of temperatures this time of year. Here's six o'clock this morning. The rain will stay at bay back to our west until about 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Now we pause here from Bloomington to Columbus, and you can see that rain already working its way into the southern tier of the state. And then as we get into the 5 o'clock hour today, the rain takes back over really for the rest of us through the central part of the state along the I-70 corridor, and it lifts in northward, and then it just becomes widespread. So after about 5 p.m., showers, fair game for everybody, and that's going to continue through early Sunday. Here's 7 o'clock in the morning, early tomorrow, and then the showers will slowly start to taper off around lunchtime tomorrow, and then as this system pools off to the east, we'll see that sky gradually clearing. I think we'll still recover back to the lower 60s with a little sunshine late in the day on Sunday, so not a complete washout tomorrow, although it will be a wet start, so I want you to be prepared for that. Otherwise, might not be a bad idea to make some plans to get outside, especially tomorrow afternoon after that rain moves out. Temperatures are set to recover back into the lower 60s from Indianapolis to Greencastle. Terre Haute even around 64 tomorrow and Richmond around 57, just a touch cooler because of the cloud cover that's going to linger the second half of the day. 66 today, 62 tomorrow with some sunshine that's going to wrap up your weekend. A warmer, drier day on Monday to start next week around 64 degrees after a cool start of just 39. And then we're uh, seasonally warm beyond that. Chance of showers on Tuesday, but a high near 70 will be the warmest day in the extended forecast. Looking ahead, Wednesday of next week does look like it's going to be pretty wet. So we'll have showers and thunderstorms in the forecast, highs in the low 60s, a little cooler behind that system on Thursday near 60 for a high, and then back to 66 with some sunshine to wrap up the work week.